Previously, we got a glimpse of Next.js's file-based routing system. We saw how the page.tsx file in the app folder maps to our root domain and how page.tsx files in subfolders create routes matching their folder names, like about and profile. Now let's tackle nested routes. In scenario three, we need to set up a page that shows up when users visit localhost 3000 slash blog. We will also need to handle two additional routes, localhost 3000 slash blog slash first and localhost 3000 slash blog slash second. Let me show you how easy this is with the app router. First up, let's create a block folder inside our app directory. Inside this block folder, we will add page.tsx file with a simple React component exported as default. So page.tsx and the React component export default function blog that returns an h1 tag my blog. If we save this and check localhost 3000 slash blog, we will see our blog page right away. That takes care of the first part of scenario three. But what about these nested routes? Slash blog slash first and slash blog slash second. This is where Next.js really shines. We can simply create two new folders inside the block folder named first and second. So new folder, first, new folder, second. In each folder, we will create a page.tsx file with its own component exported as default. page.tsx and another page.tsx. We export a default function called first blog that returns an h1 tag first blog post. And in the other, we export a default function second blog that returns an h1 tag second blog post. Save the files. Navigate to localhost 3000 slash blog slash first and you will see the first blog page render exactly where it should. And similarly, when you navigate to slash blog slash second, you will see the second blog page. Just like that, we've implemented scenario number three. Here's a visualization of how these nested routes work. Page.tsx in the app folder corresponds to the root route. Page.tsx in the blog folder corresponds to slash blog. Page.tsx in the first folder corresponds to slash blog slash first and similarly, slash blog slash second. The key takeaway here is that Next.js mirrors your folder structure in your URLs automatically. It is that simple. Up next, we will check out something even more powerful, dynamic routes. Supporting the channel is free. Please like and subscribe. It helps a lot.